So let's let's talk a little bit about the uh, the brand new 2010 uh, XC 29 or Perry. All right, what I'm talking about here today at Bicycle Warehouse is uh, Giant has introduced uh, two models of aluminum and two models of, uh, of blended carbon fiber and aluminum 29 inch bikes. They're the XTC 291 and the 292. Uh, what I'm going to show you is some of the better features of what Giant brought into the 29 world. Well, what our whole goal was making our 29er was to make a bike that had the benefits of the 29 inch wheels, rolls over things better, a little bit more speed on the straights, but we wanted to make the bike handle like you were riding a 26 inch bike. What, we're, what we did on the bike is we worked to really shorten the rear section of the bike. Uh, that puts the rear end right up underneath you, helps you climb a lot. You can see a little curve in the seat tube right there. That gives us so we can have the rear section as short, but we don't cramp the front end of the geometry of the bike. Another thing that we've done at Giant, we draw all of our own tubing. There's a lot of torque that's put on a 29 inch bike, more than a 26 inch. So the way we shape the tubes was how we can make them as thin and as light as possible, but also stiff to keep from flexing. You can see how we did the whole front end of this bike, which is all fluid form tubing. One thing you're probably noticing looking at the front end is the head tube. It's a super small head tube, but what we've done is we use a lot bigger bearing on the bottom. We use an inch and a half bearing on the bottom and an inch and an eighth on the top. We, we, Fox Forks is one of our partners and they made a special uh, fork with a tapered steering tube on it to help strengthen the front end of this bicycle yet keep the front end of it down. Also what we've done is we've, Giant is now making components for the bicycle. You can see the rims on this bicycle. Uh, we make the special rim special for a 29 inch bike. And it's not just special because it fits a 29 inch tire, but the depth of the rim and also the width of the rim. This rim is as stiff as a 26 inch wheel using the specific rim that we've designed for this bike. Also, the handlebars and the stem. This, you see, that it's got a flat bar that's really wide here. This is a specific 29-inch uh, handlebar that we use on this bike because you do need a little bit more torque with this bike, so it's a it's a wider bar. Uh, it really makes the bike handle great. I rode one of these bikes when I was in Keystone, and it really felt like riding a 26-inch hardtail.